Welcome back to Triple R. We have a G.I. Joe classified series, Akiko, from the Snake Eyes movie. I didn't like the Snake Eyes movie. I barely remember who this is, if at all. It's pretty good art on the side here. But it was a cool looking character, and it was five bucks. So, that's a good price, I think, for this kind of action figure. And I like to give him some weapons. It was a cool looking action figure, I think. So that's Snake Eyes in the back, which is dumb. You should just have this. If anything, just have this print on the back. I don't <laughs> understand why he did that. Also, there's no stats on this box. Um, I guess the symbol might mean something. But nothing about <laughs> the character of Kiko. This is from the movie, and there's a big thing of Snake Eyes. That's dumb. All right, let's check out the action figure, though. I'm going to leave her in the box. Snake Eyes symbol on the back again. A lot of like, this is Snake Eyes kind of stuff on this box. Yeah, not a fan of that movie. I didn't, I didn't like it. Alright, these are always kind of a pain to pop out. I don't know why this feels more bare bones than the other ones. But anyway, $4.99. I'm not going to complain too much. All action figure reviews, right? You're supposed to head articulation, elbows, knees, waist, not really. Uh, stiff in the upper legs as well. It looks pretty good. Again, I, I'm not sure. <laughs> I saw the movie, can't remember exactly much about this character. Um, let's see if she holds her weapons. Well, that popped out easy. Got blades here. Mic is messing up for whatever reason. Alright. So, I any way to hold all these weapons? Not really. So, I don't think. Give her like something back there. Bow staff. I guess it's supposed to be bladed. I'm not sure. Well, I'm sure she doesn't hold it by the blades. So this hand is closed. Kind of get in there. There we go. As an action figure, though, I think she looks good. Some pretty cool gear. The black and the white. Got the belt. Face sculpt looks good. Alright. Hold that. That's well. So I would think the same way with these. Maybe. I just feel like if I force these things, they're going to snap. Alright. Got the dual wield. I'm sure this is the dual wield and the single. So, uh, what do you do? They stay on nice. That's good. Let's see. Any problems standing with this stuff? No. It's like a faux heel kind of thing. Pegs? Yep, got pegs. Okay. Peg holders, I guess. Well, stays a lot better than the Fortnite character. That's for sure. Didn't have to do too much moving around. Just gotta balance the bit like with anything. Maybe. Could be wrong. She won't stand up. <laughs> Alright. Five bucks though. I'm satisfied with this action figure. A Kiko, G.I. Joe Classified Series. Like that. Ollie's currently. It's 
So there's the better art of her. This is Snake Eyes. And right here as well. Three weapons. And I guess your standard action figure quality these days. If not, maybe maybe a little better. It's not too bad. Thanks for watching Triple R. Have a good day or night, wherever you are.